This is exactly how I researched the anime niche. So let's get straight into it. And then we'll get into how to write the listing for Merch by Amazon. All right, came over here to merchresearch.com. Okay, I'm gonna leave everything blank here and I'm just gonna go ahead and hit search. All right, what that's gonna do, it's gonna bring me over here to all the Merch by Amazon t-shirts, right? And then what I'm gonna do is just not sort by, I'm just gonna leave this by featured, okay? And then I'm gonna come over here to the bottom left and hit newest new arrivals the last 30 days. And what that's gonna do is filter out by the last 30 days and it's gonna show us what is selling right now. Okay, and what's hot. You're gonna see the one it's what's been popping out to me, you know, the last few days I've been well, the last few weeks I've been doing this is the anime niche, right? Um, and just kind of think about okay, how can I uh make some content on this to you know serve it to you guys so you guys can see exactly the way that i've done this okay this right here i'm using so you can see there's, there's some bsrs here already and the anime niche right and i'm saying okay cool this is good this is good so i'm thinking okay looking at you know there's obviously funny sayings with eating sleep anime you know donuts and foods video games stuff like that you want to be very careful with using like you know that looks exactly like almost similar to the playstation controller right um you know sketching and anime so they're just basically you know mixing two niches together right and combining them with the anime niche so you want to think about okay what can you do right here so that's what i was thinking about okay what can i do in this niche that's going to stand out and maybe i could be you know different from everyone else in the niche you have the sub niche down because it's gonna basically what's doing right there is you just it's you don't want to you want to create something that's different that has like barely any competition okay um so that's what i did and it came up and i came up with the design which you'll see right now coming up so anime obviously right so i'm gonna go into the anime niche created a design we're gonna optimize we're gonna optimize the listing and how i would list it and then you know put it live on amazon and then as you can you just go down this there's like there's so much like good like new niches in here that can be made obviously you have to be careful okay i'm saying i'm seeing a lot of this Take him to the train station Yellowstone. I think this is a TV show right here. So you have to be careful. Okay. If you just made any designs for this, you want to be very careful on how you're designing for this because you do not want to create something that's infringing, you know, like on a TV show or something like that. Okay. You're like, you're leveraging that brand and what that TV show series is creating. And then you're making design t-shirts designs for that, which you don't have the rights to, so you can get in trouble. So be careful with that, with how you're designing for that. If you're doing that and you're in that niche, you just want to be very, very careful. All right. And you're seeing like a lot of the new, like something that I found out right here too, as well. If you look at the snowman, you see what the design that's going on with the snowman, which is really cool. It's really too late for that. But next year, there's some ideas right here. Okay. There's a lot of different stuff that you can do right here. Different types of snowman faces, but you can see that the BSR was, you know, crashing. It's a little bit too late for that, of course. Uh, but just think of ideas, right? Look at this one, this French Bulldog. It's, it, it was making sales. It was crushing it, right? Um, which is really, really amazing. So, yeah. Um, now, if you want to take a little bit step further, you can see that the BSR is crushing. But if you click on here, come down to the listing, okay? You're going to see that it was uploaded November 25th, 2021. The BSR. See that bad boy? And then... If you use this helium 10 tool, you can see this type of, you know, what it was doing before, before Christmas, right? You can see, right? Was these, these, these were getting, you know, shipped on time before Christmas. Now they're arriving after Christmas. You can see that the damage that it was doing. Okay. Which is very, very powerful because next year around or just, even this is an evergreen niche. This is going to last all, you know, all year, all year, all year long. Okay. Even the next holiday that's coming up these people might be buying them, you know, you know, as Christmas gifts. So think about stuff like that. Evergreen niche, which is really awesome because next, next uh, Q4, this is going to crush again. Okay. All right. So this is the design that I came up with. There's no such thing as cartoons, only anime. I put it up on, you know, all the products right here. And uh, the tool that I use in this, um, it's going to be Helium 10, you know, uh, merchant a little bit of merchant former a little bit of productor um just throughout the whole video uh making the listing i use a helium 10 as you can see i put it up on the uh all the hoodie i used the productor to uh convert the design over into you know the, the hoodie and the zip up hoodie and then the pop socket too as well i won't upload it to the phone case or nothing like that just for this example we're just going to do it like this 
um, I'm translating it over in to the other marketplaces. Okay, so I'm letting uh, Merch by Amazon do that for me, which is really awesome. Um, this right here, this is a tool right here. It's the Merch Informer Trademark Check. Um, really awesome tool. Um, as I do that, just double check and making sure there's no trademarks so we look like we're in the clear, right? Um, now, this is what I came up with, okay? The title, the brand, okay? This is gonna, I'm gonna put this up live on, you know, uh, on, on uh, Amazon, right? And let's see if we can, I'll make a, a updated video if it, once it makes it sell. Um, now, what I went with was at the very beginning, I just used the title of the design, right? You can see how I put all together, the whole listing. Okay, the brand name, I just put anime and I put RM, okay, for, you know, RJ Martinez. And then uh, the design title, like I said, I put the saying of the design on the front. And then, you know, I put the keywords animation face. Okay, kind of just more describing the actual design. I was doing a little bit of research using Helium 10. And I'll, I'll, I'll kind of go into detail about how I went over that. Um, the bullet point one, you can see uh, the information that I put here. Bullet point two, you can see everything that I put together right there um, as well. Um, the whole process of doing this, right? Um, the, one of my favorite tools I like to use is Helium 10, okay? Um, let's go back down. You're gonna see basically how everything I came up with the design. I mean, with the, with the keywords and all that stuff that I put in the entire listing. What I like to, okay, what I like to do, I like to, you know, mess around with Celebro, right? This is $37 a month. You can do it the free way. You can literally go on amazon.com and you can, you can use the search bar right here. If you come over here, you see this right here, this is everything that's popping up right here, eat, sleep, anime. You can see different shirt ideas and stuff like that. Okay. This tool right here is the AMZ Suggestion Expander. It's a Chrome extension. It's right up here. You see that in the right, right hand corner. It's a very awesome tool. You can use this, right? But the cool thing with Helium 10, um, the Celebro tool, like I, it kind of, this is awesome. You could go and, you know, you go back and forth and go through all this stuff. But I love to use this because I like to see what keywords are popping up in here. Okay. Um, this was very interesting. I, 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 the competing products, I did by 500. Um, the goal, you know, well, obviously the goal is to the less competing products, the better. But then like with this one right here, I'm kind of shooting for a home run because it's a really cool, I think it's a really awesome design. What, what was we put, I put it all together and how we came up with it. I think it's a really awesome design. I keep on saying we, it's because, you know, I don't design a lot of this stuff. I have a team that helps me design. And, um, you know, I come up with the ideas and the research and the saying sometimes. And I put this together for you guys in this video to kind of show you guys exactly how it would be done and how I would do it personally and try to, you know, you know, dive into this niche and, and make a sell. Okay. Um, now, there's no guarantees that this design will make a sell, right? Um, at the end of the day, we're, you know, we're, if we're all putting a design up on Merch by Amazon, we're all competing with each other, right? But what I would do is the whole process of me putting, I put together this whole listing um, and I have video, other videos on my channel too, is, is going through all this stuff, okay? Seeing what fits for me personally when I'm doing all the, the research and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm betting on this phrase right here, okay? And then I'm adding, you know, like animation and then face. Okay, that right there is going to, basically, this is the long tail keyword that I'm going for. Okay, this phrase right here, if someone likes this phrase and they make a purchase or they start to see it, it goes on Amazon and they will convert for that and then it'll start popping up on Amazon, right? And then, uh, you know, anime, you know, anime, animation, face, you know, that would can be a, obviously a search term. And just diving into these keywords and putting these long tail keywords into your title, you know, and you can do in the brand too as well. Um, but it just, it's just the way you want to do it, right? I could probably add another keyword right here if I want to, right? I may do that. I'm not sure yet. I'm a, but I'm just, this is the whole process, but this is design, this di design is going to be live on Amazon, but going back, keyword research is very important. Okay. So you coming into Amazon and doing research, okay. Um, is one of the most important things and looking at, you know, looking at a, a shirt that's ranking really well and making a lot of sales. You're gonna see like what it's popping up for, okay? Anime lover, you're seeing a lot of that, okay? I may I may come back in there and, and, and remix a, a few of the things on there so you can and you see exactly what it is. I, I might not that might not be the final steps right there, but I did put it all together. Um, anime clothing for men, anime T-shirt for men. We've seen this in the search bar, right? And you can see if you look at this, you know it's it's trending like crazy. 
um, especially in Q4, it was going crazy, going off the chains, but there's a lot of competing products, right? So it's like, okay, if there's that many competing products, how are you going to stand out? And I'm thinking just, you know, different sayings in that niche, different funny sayings that you can put in that niche to help you stand out. Okay. That's what I'm thinking. Or, you know, that little trick that I just did 500, boom, you know, or even lower than that. If you want to go even lower, you can even do that too as well. Okay. But if a, a competing, a, a, a niche with a lot of competing products and a lot of competition, you want to dig in deeper and figure out, okay, maybe you can create a unique saying in this niche that no one else has. And then once you start making sales, you have a chance to rank for these crazy competing products, right? I mean, these crazy cre uh, competing like long tail keywords with a lot of competition in there, right? And that's how you would do it, right? That's how you would break into the niche. So understand that, which is important. And this is exactly the way I would do it. Um, and then you can just dive into, you know, you can see there's a, a ton of awesome designs in, in this freaking niche. There's, a, so there's so many different designs. So I'm just looking at a lot of this stuff and seeing what keywords you know, I can use, you know, in my niche that people are searching for. So that's how powerful this tool is. Okay. Um, pause my animated B here. And what I did was did a, uh, the keyword search right here, keywords and boom, came over here and, you know, seeing what's going on. So this is what I came up with. I'm going to put this live. Like I said, I may change a few words and I'm going to put it live. Um, you can see all the other products that I uploaded to. Okay. Um, which is really, really awesome. I'll do an updated video once this makes a sell. If it makes a sell, we I'll make an updated video and then show you the results of it, and you know show you. And you know, I'm gonna run some AMS ads to this tool as well, and we'll we'll dive in deep in that too, and go into more detail. If it makes a sell, we'll go into the next video where I'll talk about you know the AMS ads and all that fun stuff and how it made a sell, what it converted for, whatever it is. My main focus here is kind of just a quick overview over everything. Okay brand name you know a uh, keyword in there okay a long tail keyword or keyword design title i i would use either the phrase of the shirt at the beginning but you want to try to put two the goal is to put two long tail keywords in there okay which would be you know this right here animation face here anime you know this can even be a keyword too here you know so just trying to fit as many long tail keywords as possible in the title to help you rank and get more traffic to it and then the bullet points and bullet point two will come next um, I'll, the product description, I really don't fill, fill that out too much. I leave it as is, um, but this is these two right here are your main focus. Okay. Brand and title. And if you like this video, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Uh, hopefully I helped you with understanding how to write your listing on merch by Amazon. And if you want to jo join my private ready aim scale group, private mastermind group, it will be down below in the description. I do also have a merch by Amazon course which will be down below in the description and watch my next video if you want to go dive in deeper okay with niche research right up here